Back in Summer Bay, Cash discovered that both Tim's car and the Lyric Sharehouse had been vandalized. Cash rushed to Lyric's silent retreat to protect them, but when he tried explaining his fears about Nerida, Tim refused to listen, fed up of Cash's interference. Remy had previously spotted the pair arguing, and in the final scenes of the year, Justin came around the corner to find Cash standing over Tim's lifeless body. What wasn't clear was whether Cash had taken things too far, or whether Nerida had also made her way to the island and was involved in the attack. Cash awoke to find his hands covered in blood, with Tim lying unconscious next to him, and it looks like he's going to have a tough time clearing his name when we return to Summer Bay in 2025. Meanwhile, Harper agreed to a risky operation to remove a cyst on her and Tane's unborn baby's lung. Harper initially decided against the op, telling Tane that nobody is operating on my baby, but the finale saw Levi explain that the cyst was still growing, and she eventually agreed to head into surgery. However, Levi was hiding his fears about the operation, having never carried it out before, with the fact it was on a friend's baby adding to his stress levels. The show now takes a break for the next six weeks, and we won't find out whether Tim, Harper and the unborn baby survive until Home and Away returns to Australian screens in January. While we wait, here's all we know about what's coming up in Summer Bay in 2025, 